everyone. Today I'm going to review the Hisense RB335 N4 WB1 50-50 Frost Free Fridge Freezer from AO.com. I'm going to get some basics out of the way first. So it is 185 centimeters tall, it's 55 centimeters wide and 60 meters uh, centimeters sorry in depth. So it's actually an A plus energy rated a fridge freezer. So what that means is that it's really economical. It means it'll save you on your bills in the long run, and it's actually greener to the environment. Um, the second thing is that it has a two year guarantee. So what that means is that you've got that peace of mind for a couple of years to make sure that it actually works and does what you want it to do. Obviously you can get extra insurance, etc. Um, in terms of this fridge freezer specifically, you get a total no frost guarantee. So what that means is if you've got your vegetables and products in the fridge, you don't expect to see it all frosty and you know when it gets really soggy, uh, especially in cucumbers, I absolutely hate it, <laughs> don't know why, but I do, um, so yay me, I'm not going to get that anymore. Um, please do excuse the fact that we don't have many products in there, we are definitely not used to having so much space, <laughs> so great and I'm looking forward to filling that up, but today I'm going to show you basically how it looks inside. Um, how to use this water dispenser and what the fridge freezer settings look like etc. Firstly here's what the fridge looks like inside. So you get your trays as normal. I've put milk and sauces on that. Then this section here is actually the water dispenser so I'm going to show you how to use that because you enter and put the water right there. Uh, then there's another tray um, and another one at the top there. Plus you get those egg holders as well. Enough for a dozen eggs which is great. Then you get this bottles tray. As you can see there's a mixture of alcohol and fizzy drinks. Then there's a few other trays that you can use and put whatever you want on there. And then there's a tray at the bottom for vegetables as usual, so like fresh stuff. Here's what it looks like. Now I'm going to show you how to use the settings. Right, so these are the settings up here. This one's the fridge one, this one's the freezer one. In order to change the temperatures, you just press on this button here. I think the average is around minus 18 for the freezer and then about 3 for the fridge. Um, we've looked it up on the internet and they just suggested that generally that's what they would choose. So we thought we'd give it a go and it seems to be working for us so why not. Um, something clever that um, this fridge freezer does actually is it has a holiday mode. What that means is that it um, turns your fridge to around 15 degrees Celsius which is usually quite low and um, keeps the freezer running so what that means is that you can get rid of the things that will go off whilst you're on holiday but your freezer will still work and um, your drinks will still be a little bit chilled, which is I think is pretty cool because it saves on energy. So keep a hold of the fridge for three seconds and as you can see it's changed to holiday mode. To turn it off you do exactly the same and then it goes back to normal. And then on the other side if you do the same, so you hold it for three seconds, you'll get super freeze and you can see that it's gone to minus 24 which is crazy freezing temperature <laughs> um, and then you get rid of it by doing the same thing so it might come in useful for example um, when you first get your fridge freezer um, obviously wait for a few hours for it to settle like uh, recommended 
um, and then switch it on. Right, so going back to the water dispenser, this is where it is held um, and I'm going to show you how to fill it up. Um, take a jug with some water, open up this bit on the right hand side, as you can see you'll be able to just pour the water in and I've actually managed to fit in four full jugs of water in here in order to use the fridge water dispenser. So I'm going to show you how to do that. There's actually a lock and an unlock um, system. So what you do in order to use it, you unlock it and you simply press the button with the glass and the water comes out. <laughs> Fantastic. Um, something I would recommend is that um, before you actually start using it, make sure that you filter the water out a couple of times just to make sure there's no germs and stuff in there, you know, like the normal stuff. But yeah, and then you can enjoy your drink. The freezer, as you can see, there's three trays, two really big ones, one medium one, and at the top there's a tray. So we use it mostly for um, ice cubes, then... Um, ice cream as well but it's completely up to you what you use the tray for. It actually came with this um, ice cube tray which is fantastic because it's got a lid. It's quite cool. Um, here's the first tray just to show you what it might look like space wise. I've fitted in quite a few things in there. And then here we've got loads. We have a lot of frozen stuff as we don't usually manage to finish the fresh. We even have bread in the freezer for toast. Yep, we're weird like that. <laughs> so there you have it. Before I finish up, um, I think the um, door's actually quite nice and thick, which is makes it sturdy, especially if you've got like a family. Um, and you've got kids slamming the doors and stuff like that. <laughs> we don't, luckily. My puppy doesn't go around opening and closing fridges. <laughs> um, so it, it seems quite sturdy and it is going to last by the looks of things. Um, I also would like to say thank you to AO who actually sent me the fridge freezer for review and their delivery was actually really fast. The guys took the fridge freezer off their van uncovered it really fast, put it in, in, in its place, um, even offered to take the old appliance, which really surprised me and it was really nice of them to do. Um, so there's that option there for you as well. Well, I hope you enjoyed this review and I really hope that you enjoy your new fridge freezer as well. Thanks so much for watching.